Hi guys, I thought I would give you a bit of a blog update, meaning that it's Christmas Eve and we missed out on about four weeks of blogs. So I did actually type them all up, but we had a power surge overnight, not last night, but a few weeks ago, and I lost everything. So I thought I would put it into a vlog for you. So excuse me as I look um, to the computer and back. Um, so I, fi I finished my reverse diet and I'm into maintenance now, but so just going how we ended the reverse, so I was tracking okay in the 44-ish millimoles at week um, four of the reverse. And then into week five, I had a couple of really high days early in the week and then um, some medium days and I tried to pull my calories down. Um, I, scanned, uh, I skin folded in at 44.9, so that was still pretty good. So that was still on track. Um, in week six and into week seven, still looking reasonably good, sitting about 57.7 kilos, still having one or two high days in the week and then trying to bring the calories down to make up for it. We had a little jump in week eight to 47.8 uh, in my skin folds and we've hit the 58.2 mark. Um, and again, that week I had a ridiculously high day for Stacey's comp, so I'd already planned to have a burger, but then we had burgers and we had ice creams and I had lollies and chocolate. Like it went really silly, so I had a lot, a lot of calories. So then I spent the week trying to make up for that. So I don't really want to do that moving forward. I don't want to have these ridiculously high days and then having to cut back um, and like almost like in a dieting phase again. I want to try a proper maintenance where I'm just eating good nutritious food each day. Um, moving to weeks, so that was eight weeks of the reverse. Um, moving to maintenance and my first um, skin folds with Dan after having a week off of being unwell had jumped up to 53.6 and 58.3. So my kilos didn't go up very much but my skin folds did. Um, and that's where I was like, okay, definitely no more food here and we'll just maintain and see how we go. Um, the week after that, my skin folds dropped to 52.4, weight up a fraction, 58.5, but a little bit more, still had a high day, but a little bit more controlled. So um, I am due for my check-in today, um, and so I feel like I am definitely in maintenance. I feel like I haven't really gained much. I definitely haven't lost, I'm starting to get that. I um, can feel my legs, I can feel like I've definitely put on a little bit of weight, but I'm still, I'm not unhappy and I just need to focus on building that muscle. Um, we just got the dates for season B of nine, uh, 2021, which is the 16th of October, which is great. It means I've got plenty of time to build. Um, so I just want to keep that fat gain down as much as I can and get that muscle mass going. So we will see what today brings and I will keep you updated. And I also might give you a quick um, update after my check-in today of my plan for Christmas. All right. So on our way to check-in, I think I just rushed that last video a little bit much. So just to clarify, I spent about four weeks slowly gaining some weight um, to a point where we wanted to cut it off there. So about the, the early 50s. Um, and then last week managed to drop down a little bit. So we will see what today's check-in holds. And then like I said, I will give you my plan for Christmas. Service in this morning, see? Mm -hmm. She's just offering an extra service. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, I told you I'm happy as fuck. Uh, I just don't care, I'm happy. Sure did, but she <laughs> 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 well, that was a shit. That was a bit of a surprise. Um, skin folds are way up and weight is up. So weight is up 59.4, so up almost one kilo, so 900 grams. And skin folds are up like 7.2 millimoles. Um, but just having a look at the skin fold sites and chatting to Dan, it's only up in my tricep. So it's a bit weird. Most of the others have stayed exactly the same. So like I thought it was maintenance. Um, so whether it's a hormonal thing or whether it's just an incorrect skin fold, I, I'm not sure, um, but we'll, we won't know now because now it's going to be Christmas. Obviously, my skin folds are probably going to go up. We may end up having to do a little um, a, a mini diet, mini cut in January or something like that, but I'll still try and keep it reasonably under control over Christmas. Um, so my plan is to enjoy tomorrow and back on track Boxing Day, basically. Um, 
because my goals are super important to me and I don't want one to eat to go from one day to the next to the next to the next and that's when you end up really blowing out before you know I put on weight quite easily so before I know it I'll be too far gone <laughs> so oh and excuse me I always check in in these same clothes so I know they're super grotty now but I just use the same clothes and this is from learning skin fold so I've got like pen marks all over me so I was learning to do skin folds and they're a lot harder than they look anyway so that's a wrap for before Christmas maybe even 2020 and we'll start fresh next year with you know my first check-in for the year and then we'll create a plan and go from there so welcome to my vlogs and to my channel and it should hopefully just get bigger and better each week bye guys have a good Christmas <laughs>